Hi, so I am actually doing a part two to my part one video. Uh, the reason for that is because once again, the video is just way too long. So without further ado, let's just get into the video. BHA 30% plus BHA 2% peeling solution. So the AHA 30% plus BHA 2% is exactly how it sounds. It's a peeling solution. It gives your skin a chance to experience deep exfoliation. And um, some of the ingredients, just quickly, are the glycolic acid, lactic acid, and salicylic acid. Now the glycolic acid and the um, lactic acid, they actually help to exfoliate the skin. And the salicylic acid, that is good for reducing pore size. This product contains pepperberry plant, which I believe, I wanna say it's from Tasmania. And this pepperberry plant helps calm skin irritation. Let me show you really quick. So this is the product right here. I do wanna mention though that um, this is red. I mean, this is red, red, red. This will stain, so I definitely would not use this product if I'm using, if I'm wearing like my favorite shirt or if I'm wearing something that I would get really upset about if it were to get stained, yeah. Uh, be mindful for what you're wearing when using this product. I, it does have the possible chance of staining your clothes. So this product helps improve skin radiance and improves the appearance of skin texture. It reduces fine lines. It does not contain alcohol, gluten, nuts, oil, silicone, parabens, or sulfates. So to use this product, what you would do is cleanse your face. After cleansing your face, wait for your skin to dry completely. So wait for your um, face to dry completely before applying this product to your face. Do not apply this product to your face if your skin is still wet. Once you apply the product to your face, make sure that you apply it um, evenly. And if you want, you can actually apply it to your neck as well. Wait 10 minutes and then wash it off with lukewarm water. Do not keep this product on your face more than 10 minutes. And you can also use this product once a week. I mean, if you're like really crazy with it, you could use it, I would say two times a week, but I would not use it more than that because it is a peeling solution. Keep that in mind. I would not use this product more than twice a week. I personally, I love this product. This is like one of my go-to products from The Ordinary that if I want like an instant glow or like an instant pick-me-up, yeah, I'm reaching for this product. This product, I'm telling you, it is like one of the very few products that once I use it and I've rinsed my skin off after using it, I notice immediately a difference to my skin. There's a definite radiance to my skin after using this product. I absolutely love this product. I cannot say good enough things about this product. I think that I will be using this product forever. I hope Ordinary never um, gets rid of this product. I hope that they continue to always sell this product. I just like and I love it. On to the next one. Grand Active Retinoid 2% Emulsion. So the Grand Active Retinoid 2% Emulsion is a stable serum that targets visible signs of aging without skin irritation. It helps with uneven skin texture, dullness, fine lines, and wrinkles. This product is free of sulfates, paraben. It's formulated without oil, without silicone. There's no uh, alcohol in it, no nuts. It's fragrance-free, gluten-free. It's vegan, plus it's cruelty-free. It's good for oily, combination, normal, and sensitive and dry skin types. The way that you apply this product is just, you just need to use a tiny amount of this product and apply it in the p.m. So apply it at night. I would not use this product during the day. The reason for that is because there is a 
um, chance of increased sun sensitivity when using this product. You should always remember to use sunscreen, um, but even still, I just would not go and be outside in the sun if I'm using this product. Another thing with this product is if you're using, let me see, where is it? Here it is. Okay, this is it. So if you are using a retinoid, don't use this product. Don't mix two retinoids together. That's another thing. If you're you if you're currently using a retinoid, do not use this retinoid as well. Use only one retinoid at a time. And the other thing that I just want to mention with this product is that um, if you're pregnant or breastfeeding, please do not use this product, as it is recommended not to use any products containing retinoid if you're pregnant or breastfeeding. You can store this product in the fridge if you want. Definitely keep it out of the sun, keep it out of the light, keep it in a place where it's um, protected from the light, but in a dark, cool place. So personally me, I store it in the fridge. This is also, this right here, the Grand Active Retinoid. This is also for me a go-to, one of my go-to. I love this product. I use it all the time and I've used it for many years and it's working so I'm gonna keep using it. Alright so last but definitely not least the niacinamide 10% plus zinc 1%. So the niacinamide 10% plus zinc 1% um it's a it's vitamin B3 that's what it is. So it's vitamin B3 and it helps with an even skin tone. It helps with reducing the appearance of enlarged pores, provides hydration to the skin, and it's good for wrinkle prevention. Niacinamide helps um, the skin retain a, like a bright, youthful, plump appearance. It's also great for correcting uneven skin tone and um, I don't have it myself, but that this product is really good for people who have rosacea. So if you do have rosacea, you might want to think about just giving this product a try and see if it helps with your condition. Where is it here? Um, it's somewhere. Here it is. So this is the nice and right here. Nice and my 10% plus zinc. It's good for um, people who have normal skin, combination, sensitive, dry, and oily skin types. It's formulated without parabens, without sulfates. The product is vegan and cruelty-free. It's also formulated without alcohol, nuts, gluten, silicone, and fragrance. The way that I use this product is I use it at night. Um, before using a serum. I can use this product and not use a serum and that's fine. I really, really, really like this product. In my other video, I was speaking about the um, Arbutin. I don't have it with me and I really don't want to get up right now and go get it. But I use it in combination with the niacinamide and it's given me such great results with my skin with the texture of my skin. I really like using both of them. I mean, you don't have to use both of those products together, but I'm just throwing it out there. If you want, I would totally suggest using the niacinamide 10% plus zinc 1% in combination with the Arbutin. Alright, so that was just my video on some of the products that I use from The Ordinary. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider subscribing and give this video a thumbs up. And thank you so much for watching. And remember to always kiss the ones you love, no matter how near or far. Until next time, bye!